Late change in City's lineup. Mickey Moore injured during the warm up, so she's replaced by Anna Oscarson. Charlotte Wardlaw kept title hopes alive midweek with her equaliser against Celtic. She starts again. Shannon McGregor returns to the Hibs 11 after injury, as does Maya Christie. Leah Eddy and Abby Ferguson are fit enough for the bench. There's Amy Muir. Against star former club today. Oh, and that's a risky one from Gibson, which is perhaps opened the door here for Ellis Notley. Tegan Bowie. And City survive. Forrest's cross. And Anna Oscarson arrives. What about that for a twist of fate? A late addition to the lineup. And first on the score sheet at Peters Hill. Really well done from the Swedes. Not late. Unable to gather it. Sent forward by Gambon for Forrest. Oh, what a save from Frayne. Tremendous reactions. And there's all this touch here, which allows Jody and Balcom to have a swing. I think Gibson knew it was drifting wide. Rangers next for Glasgow City, before Partick Thistle away and Hearts at home to finish the season. And if they win today, they'll have the chance to draw level with Rangers next week, provided Celtic beat Rangers on Monday afternoon. And they might have an opening here to double their lead right at the start of the second half. Not at the first time of asking, but it's thumped home by Guillemona at the second. Well, there are no pictures on a score sheet. And Glasgow City are in firm control of this now. Maybe a weak tackle from Lawson. As City side through Hibs. Tall order now for the Hibbies. Oh, what a touch from Shannon McGregor. He's looking to play it through for Balcom. Oh, I don't think Gibson knew whether or not she could pick up. And once again, City, almost the architects of their own downfall. This time it's Hibbs, stronger in the tackle. Ten minutes or so to turn City's life upside down here. Morrison back for Balcom. Oh, have some of that. What a finish from the American. And it's goals like that that have led to her inclusion in team of the season. Wonderful strike. And let's see what City are made of here. Another one for Hibbs, and it's pretty much curtains for their title hopes. There's Leishman, stronger than Colville. Into the embers. Kept alive by Tweedy. And Lawson strikes! And has that switched out the light on Glasgow City's title hopes? At best, at the end of the weekend, they'll be five behind Celtic or Rangers. What a finish from Lawson. Atoning for our earlier error. What a turnaround.